Can you already guess what we're going to talk about today? Mm-hmm. The whistle register. How to sing those whistle notes. My name is Janice, author of Unlock Your Voice: The Secrets to Singing, and head vocal coach of Life Academy. I get asked this a lot. How can I sing in my whistle register? Well, the good news is this: whether you are male or female, you're going to be able to do this. Although this whistle register sort of singing is made popular most of the time by female singers like Minnie Riperton, Mariah Carey, and Ariana Grande, but you know, over and over again, men have proven that they are able to sing in whistle notes as well. And the reason is simple. It's because when we sing in the whistle register, our vocal cords, they're doing something different. Okay, so usually when we sing, our vocal cords, vocal cords vibrate at its full length. But when we sing in the whistle register, it's not vibrating at its full length. Instead, it vibrates only at the small anterior part of the full vocal cords. So in other words, it doesn't matter how thick your vocal cords are made, you know, how big they are, which pretty much determines how low pitch your voice may be. Because what matters is how good you are at zipping up all of these cords and allowing only a fraction of those cords to vibrate in the interior part of your vocal cords. So let's get down to business, all right? I'm going to lay it out for you three quick steps on how to sing in your whistle register. Now, these are quick steps. There are many other ways to get into your whistle register, but I think these three are good to start with and pretty effective. First step, make sure you use the right vocal register, all right? You want to make sure that you're using the whistle register, which pretty much resonates where your chest voice, sorry, your head voice is as well, okay? Now, if you're totally new to vocal registers, I do have a video uh, talking about vocal registers, so make sure you click on that video over there. Now, chest register means that the voice simply resonates mostly here, and the middle and the mix resonates mostly here, or vibrates mostly here, whereas the head voice is mostly here. So, the whistle register should feel like it's sitting here. That means when you're singing in a whistle register and you put your hand here, you shouldn't feel any vibration going on here. So for example, right, I'm not, um, I'm not feeling anything here. In fact, I'm not, feeling, I'm not feeling anything here as well. Most of it is somewhat here, all right? But whatever it is, it's in your head resonance area, all right? So that's the first step, making sure that you place your voice in this resonance area. The second thing is to grab a mirror and watch out for your muscles here. As you're singing higher and higher, trying to get into your vocal, your whistle register, make sure this is not going on. So this shouldn't be how it's done. Like that, not like that, alright? Instead, it should be relaxed and... The higher you go, the more relaxed you have to be. So watch out for these muscles here. All right, the third step is to phonate, you know, your vocal cord in, to phonate only or to vibrate, <laughs> how should I put this? To zip up your vocal cords so that only the interior part of your vocal cords are vibrating. Now I'm sure you're probably thinking, how do I zip up these cords? Well, um, you can liken it to the sensation of holding your breath, okay? Um, when I say hold your breath, I don't mean like, <sighs> like that, you know, but just a simple, you know, like when you do that, you can feel your vocal cords zipping up actually, all right, when you're holding your breath. So we're going to zip it up gently. Remember, the keyword here is gently. And at the same time, sing with our vocal cords zipped up. So if I zip it up like this, Alright, so those are the three steps to get you going, singing in your vocal, your whistle register. Oh my goodness, today I'm so tongue-tied. <laughs> yeah, so give that a shot and if you do have any questions on the whistle register or even the other registers or any vocal questions at all, post your questions below and I'll do my best to answer them. Now, if you want a more full-length sort of a singing lesson videos of which you know, cover other things like, you know, how to sing powerfully in your 
head voice or your chest voice and things like that, having better vocal control and flexibility, remember to go on over to my website, unlockyourvoice.com.my, subscribe and get those videos sent to you. All right, see you then. Yeah.